Hey you guys, it's Alex with Forever Flawless Lips. I wanted to jump on and do a little video about the transition that Senegence is in and as a distributor, um, how it's working out for me. Um, so I have seen lately a ton of women upset about the out of stock issue and I get it. It's super frustrating. Is it going to stop your success? No, not at all. Actually, um, if you have a bad attitude, yeah, it will. Totally will. Like, don't even start if you have a bad attitude. Um, I have had 19 girls sign up, most of them last month. Um, and I have had girls that are now like on my team that I'm not their official upline, but they are on my team because their upline is MIA, is not a good upline. Um, so I have a few girls that like I adopted, as we say, um, on my team that I help out. Because I've said this so many times, I would do it even without commissions. I don't care if I get commissions. Um, they are a wonderful bonus, but I would share this company with or without them. Um, and so I have had four girls kind of like either join my team or that I like mentor and coach um, because their, their upline is not doing that, um, or their upline did not warn them about the out-of-stock issue. Um, so let's just put it out there. There's an out-of-stock issue. Getting colors is not super easy, to say the least, but it's possible, totally possible. Um, so I warn all my girls before anyone ever signs up that there's an out-of-stock issue. Um, for the past five days, it has been really, really hard to get in, to order anything, um, to just like get on the site. It's been really hard. Um, and things are selling out really, really fast. Um, is that a bad thing? It can be frustrating, but coming from being with the company for, you know, a couple months, it used to be where I would order stuff and either it would get back ordered and I'd have to wait a month, three weeks to get my product, or it would get back ordered and I have to wait three weeks to get a refund. Um, and that sucked. So I would rather things sell out. They've adjusted it now where if it is out of stock, it'll pull it from your cart um, and give you a notification. I would rather have that any day than have my stuff back ordered and not know if I'm going to get it or have them charge my card and then wait three weeks for a refund. Um, so to me, it's gotten better in some ways and worse in some ways. Um, honestly, the out of stock issue, you guys, I have, there are women dropping like flies left and right who are just frustrated and annoyed. And I am sorry, like that is hard and I get it. Like, I get it. It's hard. I'm really sorry. It sucks. It does. But there are a lot of us who are still making well over four figures and are growing our businesses. Our businesses are exploding. Just personal sales with the out-of-stock issue. Well, how is that happening? Well, there's stuff in stock. There is a lot of like, uh, there's um, the like, nighttime routine, anti-wrinkle, um, all kinds of face stuff that you can order and trade for lip colors. Or you can order those and push those to your customers. Like our skincare line is amazing. It is absolutely amazing. I swear by it. I love it. I have women who sell Rodin and Fields who use our products and say our products works better than Rodin and Fields. And I'm not dogging Rodin and Fields. Rodin and Fields is an amazing company. Their products work really well. I'm just saying, I have women who sell Rodin and Fields who use our products and not their own. Um, there is other ways to get your 300 PV order in if that's what you're looking to do. There's ways to succeed. Do a book a bag, like order a certain amount of skincare or things that come in pumps that are sanitary and let women book a bag for a week and try out the products in there and tailor a bag to what they're interested in put product information in there, um, like the anti-wrinkle cream, put product information about anti-wrinkle cream. Um, if they're interested in anti-aging products, put anti-aging products in. If they're interested in cosmetic, some of the cosmetic stuff, 
um, order some of the cosmetic stuff that's available and put that in there. Um, get them a foundation, things like that. Let them try it before they buy it. Um, start pushing that stuff. Book parties with more mature women and bring a lot of our anti-wrinkle products. Bring a lot of like the anti-aging products. That stuff will sell. Um, you can't just build your business on lip sense because frankly, women are going to all buy enough lipstick and then it's going to kind of run out. You have to expand and bulk up your business and sell other products besides just lip sense. Whether or not there's an out of stock issue, you have to expand your business if you want to be successful in the long run. And the way to do that is push the, the other products that we have available. Um, so the out of stock issue, you guys, if you are quitting and you've made that decision in the past week, then you probably wouldn't have made it anyways because any business, any successful businesswoman goes through growing pains and goes through hard times and it is not easy to be successful. Um, any business person will tell you it, nothing gets handed to you. You have to work hard for it. Now, if in, I will say this, I will eat my words and apologize. If in a month, two months, it's worse or the out of stock issue's gotten worse or something like the company's just failing and we're all screwed. If something happens, I'm not, like I haven't drank the Kool-Aid. If I drank the Kool-Aid, I'd be making $100 a month and still be like, Cinegens is the best. Or I would have all my downlines making 100 bucks a month and trying to like proclaim that Cinegens is the best. You guys, my first commissions check my first month with the out of stock issue was not very much. It was three figures. It was still like shocking to me and I still cried. My commissions check this month is over four figures. Like they are, and I'm not saying that to brag. I'm saying that my downlines who signed up recently are still killing it. And they're doing super well. But A, I'm not saying I'm a good, amazing upline. I work my butt off to take care of my girls. Like I do everything to help them. I do check-ins. I talk to them about how to sell. I do live videos. I do trainings. Like I give them as much information as I can. And my upline and my other uplines are amazing and are so inspirational and help all of us do well. And so I feel like we have a super solid team that has a lot of information to help other women do well. Um, and also they're willing to trade with anyone or order if you don't get something and someone else does. All of our girls always order extra so that they can share with everyone else. Um, so I just feel like we have a super solid team that is helping set each other up for success. And I get that that's not the case for a lot of women. And that's really sad. And that's why I've had four other women kind of like join my team in a way because their uplines aren't available and they're not helping them. They've kind of just bailed or they like don't have any ways to help them. And that's not their fault. They probably just don't have a good example for an upline. Um, whereas like all of my uplines are so amazing and everyone's kind of helping each other out. Um, I mean, my third upline's a crown princess. So it's like all of my uplines are like very far up in the company. Um, they just they're doing really well and they're helping each other out and they're helping each other grow. So to all the women who are quitting, I'm sorry. Like I see you, you're frustrated. Please reach out to me if this is something you want to keep doing. If you're going to bail and go sell like mascara or like these other companies that I've been getting a ton of messages of women being like, Hey, come sell for me. Like I'm not going to leave Cinegents. Um, I love it. I love my girls. I've worked hard to get where I'm at and I'm not going to abandon my girls, especially when we're all doing pretty well. Um, but if you guys are leaving, like, I'm sorry. I really, I wish you the best, but I'm not going to complain about there being less distributors. Um, maybe it'll get easier to order. I know that kind of sounds like a jerk thing to say, but maybe it will. Um, for those of you that are thinking about signing up, send me a message. Like, even if you're not signing up with me, that's totally fine. I'm not saying you need to sign up with me. But if you're thinking about signing up and you just have questions and you want to ask someone besides like your potential upline, um, send me a message, foreverflawlesslips at gmail.com. I'm happy to talk about stuff. I'm happy to be super real and honest with you guys. 
I'm not gonna like over exaggerate and make you be like, this is the best ever, because it's frustrating. Like it's frustrating when you don't get colors. I get it. Um, but I want to give you like an honest, I just want to be honest with you. Like this is what it is and this is what the company's like and this is like how we're making it and this is how we're doing it on my team and this is how all my girls are doing it and how they're all succeeding. And so I'm happy to share with you guys if you need an upline that like is going to be there for you. Like my uplines are amazing. I try to take care of all my girls. Like make sure you're interviewing your upline before you jump into this business because otherwise like I see all these women quitting because they're, they didn't even like ask their upline any questions. They just signed up with someone. They didn't find out anything about the company or how they're going to work as a team or they just literally sign them up and bail. Like, it's crazy to me. Um, make sure you're interviewing your uplines and talking to them and make sure you're setting yourself up for success and asking hard questions before you get involved because you want to do well, you want to succeed. Like, this has the potential to bring in so much money for you if you do it right and you have a good upline and you know what you're getting into and you know how to work the system. So um, with that being said, if you guys have any questions, foreverflawlesslived at gmail.com or comment, I'll respond to you. Um, I respond to everyone pretty quickly. Um, I try to keep you guys, like help you guys as much as I can. Um, if you guys have any questions, send me a message. I'm here to help. I want to see everybody do well, whether they're on my team or not. So if, if your upline's not there, let me know and I'll try to help you guys out. But thank you guys.